What is up, guys? Welcome to a brand new episode of Dinkum from your favorite Dinkum YouTuber, Bring the Party. Thank you, everyone, so much for tuning on into another episode. Today, we are back at it. <gasps> the store finished. Yo, let's go. Fletch, open Fletch. You've been working hard. And I'll tell you what, it's gone. It hasn't gone unnoticed because you've increased your skill. There is a new level of logging license available. Come and see it. Come and apply to it. Cool. Hey! Morning, Josh. What's up, dude? The fish from this island are incredible. For those people back in South Bay, I mean, a blob fish? So eating anything is always a treat. Dude! Visitor site. A place where anyone visiting from Party City. Yo! John's Goods. Open 8 a.m. to 6 p.m. Close on Sundays. Closed. Yo, we finished Jones's goods. Let's go. Let's go say hi to Fletcher. Hi, Fletch. Fletcher, I keep calling her. It's Fletch. Hello there, Josh. What can I do for you? Can I let's talk about it? Ah, so you're interested in applying for a house deed. I'll just let you know it's ninety-five thousand upfront fee. Oh, in materials. So are you interested? I don't have ninety-five thousand upfront. I could probably get that today, honestly. What licenses are currently available? All right, let's see what's going on here. They said an upgraded allows the holder to craft a better axe. Sure. Nice. Copper axe. Cool. And I now make a keg. Nice. Uh, fishing license. Uh, metal. Metal detecting. I feel like I should probably buy all these, yeah? Allows you to handle... Allows the holder to buy and raise... Jukes. I feel like I just swore at you guys. If I did, it was 100% on accident, I promise. Of simple bridges. Allows the crafter to build paths. Let's do this. And also get the hunting... the A bird coop. Let's also get the... The... the, 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 the I can't even talk. Let's also get the farming one. Oh, I already got the farming one. Okay. Um, I don't want to take any of the other ones right now. So we'll come back for them. Just because I don't, I don't know what I want. And now then, what I feel like we should do... That store should be open. Let's go pop in and see what John's Goods is all about. Which is so cool. I'm so excited. Let's pick that up. Oh, no! That's on me. That's on me. Hold up. No, that's not how I... Who the heck would want it facing that way? Come on. Let's, let's use a little bit of brain there, Dinkum, alright? Insert that. Alright, cool. Let's go see what's going on. Oh, look at how big the store is. A furnace? A barbecue? No, wait, what's this middle one? A stone grinder? A furnace? Wheelbarrow? A torch? Copper bar? Mine pass? Metal detector? And then, like, oh, fishing rod. I feel like I should probably buy the fishing rod. What did I end up breaking last episode? I broke something. Uh, I don't have a pickaxe down there, so let's buy a pickaxe. Okay, so now I got a pickaxe, and then I feel like I should get another normal axe, just because I know this one's going to break. I guess I could make a new axe, but uh, we'll do it eventually. Cool. All right, and what are my daily goals? Uh, saw seven planks, catch three bugs, smash five. Oh, easy. This is easy stuff. Let's do it. So, seven planks, three bugs, five ore. Easy. First things first, let's start doing some... I guess we'll just do gum. Just because it's... I know we can do that quick. And then bugs and ore. How do you guys like the series? If you guys like the series, make sure to like and comment. Let me know if you guys are enjoying it. Uh, the way I usually judge the length of these series is based on how many of you guys want to keep watching and how many of you people are enjoying it. So the more likes, the more comments, the more content you'll get. So it's kind of, it's like a win-win, you know? You like the content, just just literally like the videos and view them. 
regularly, and then you'll get more of them. And if you don't like them, hey, then, then I'm talking to the wrong people, you know? Then you guys aren't even here to say otherwise. It doesn't really matter. But that's always how I judge my series. As you guys know, I play so uh, such a wide variety of games and a lot of indie games like this one. This one's made by one dev, which is so cool. And um, whenever these types of games come around... No. No. Oh, my pocket's already... I gotta go sell stuff. I, I shouldn't have come out this... I shouldn't have come out without clearing my inventory first. That's on me. Might be, might be. Uh, but... Yeah, so if you guys like it, just like it, watch it, you know, and then you get more. I like playing a wide variety of games. A lot of indie devs um, are like my faves. So, I guess we'll sell the meat. We'll sell the... We'll sell that. We'll sell this just because. I guess we'll sell grass seed. We'll sell gum nuts. We'll sell the cactus. We'll sell this. We'll sell that. 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 I might need that. I feel like I should just sell both these just because. I guess the rest of it's probably usable. I'm sure I'll regret selling the... Um... The gears and stuff, but like, whatever. Yeah, I'm sure someone in the comments is probably already mad at me. That's on me, guys. I'm sorry. I just... I need inventory space. And I wanted to go mining today. Go get myself a bunch of resources. I think it's going to be really good. If I remember correctly, I think Straight Out had all the resources last time. So let's just start running straight back. There was so many, like, chunks of ore back there and stuff, which... I need a lot of it right now, I think. Just because I think what we really need to start doing is uh, making copper bars and stuff. That kind of seems to be the direction we need to go as the next type of like resources copper material so let's uh let's get in a position that we can get a bunch of copper in our pockets and uh i'm sure that copper is expensive as well which is obviously our other goal is as much money as possible um so it's going to be large stacks of just supplies actually while i'm running let me just eat something just because there's no reason not to it'll be back like my be empty again all right, let's start breaking all this stuff. Oh, wait, this doesn't count as... Oh, that's interesting. This doesn't count as an ore. I kind of thought the quartz crystal would have, but I guess maybe not. Well, I know it doesn't because uh, I'm looking in the bottom left and my mission's not getting triggered by me collecting those. So let's go a little further out. Those are Cazadors. I hope that's the right name for it. You guys have told me so many times in the comments. I gotta be honest, I'm not even looking at the comments right now. Usually whenever I do one of these, I have a handful of comments up because you guys are so good at this crap and let me know when I'm dumb. Cause let me tell ya, I'm dumb. So it's really nice to have people leaving me comments. Let me know what to do and how to do it correctly. Or uh, the only reason I was able to figure out how to like bury the tree in the last episode, plant a tree was from uh, you guys let me know. Otherwise, I would have just thought this game's dumb. Luckily, you guys taught me the way. I don't know how we got a new um, axe, but not a new, a new, yeah, a new axe and not a new pickaxe. I feel like we use pickaxe so much more. Also been told countless times that I need to start cooking instead of just running around with this food, which I will eventually do, don't you worry. All this is quartz, which isn't really that useful yet. I'm maybe there's a long term use for it, and I'll keep collecting it just because I'm out here. But um Wait, what's over there? Wait, why the heck is that thing glowing? Okay, so we're not gonna mess with those. I will collect that meat and I'll keep running. Oh!
This is straight apple. I haven't seen an apple tree. Oh, this gives straight health, so not really that useful for me. But it is cool that there are apples. I haven't seen apples yet. You guys can't tell right now. I'm just running till I see more, more stuff. Oop. Pretty butterfly. Bananas. Ooh. There we go. Both of them right there. Ten and copper. Perfect. There's another quest finishing all the dailies, baby. You guys see all that? Just collect all this and let's get up there. Should eat more food? What gives? Oh, bananas is just straight energy. So I just should go find more bananas. I'll keep looking for the banana trees then. So nice. So today I spent a, I, I rode a bike for like 13 miles or something with the lady, the girlfriend. And man, it was a nice day. It was beautiful out, gorgeous weather, good Obviously, she's awesome, and we got to spend a good time with, together, but, um, she has this, we both do, you know, I shouldn't say she does, because I do too. We both really love watching 90 Day Fiance. <laughs> what a TV show, man. What characters on that show? I don't know, man. I say characters, though. They aren't really characters. They're supposed to be, like, just normal people getting married, you know? But man, is it intriguing. It's just so different and so weird. I, uh, I've been in a handful of long distance relationships. Never internationally though. Can't take credit for that. And the entire show is that these people have 90 day visas, which is like how long you can have before you have to get married in the United States on a spousal views visa. The idea is you come to the United States already ready to get married and then you get married and then you're a United States citizen. Um, Hold up, I gotta go get food now. Uh, but the people are just so interesting. It's just so different than, like, me and her. I just think they're... A lot of the times, I'm like, man, these people don't know crap. And I know they kind of probably do it for the show. The, the show needs to be entertaining, believe it or not. So, any reality TV show, everyone's gonna go a little over the top because they need to be entertaining. Otherwise, they get kicked off the show. And people on the TV show, I've even talked about it, like, not, on, not during the TV show, but off off the TV show saying, no, I lost my spot because we didn't have enough drama. So that's always like an interesting aspect. So you don't really know if they're, they're being sincere or not. Ooh, more bananas. But yeah, so we were watching that. There's like this new one on Discovery Plus called Love in Paradise. <laughs> Man, what are people doing? What are people doing? It is an intriguing TV show. It's like a guilty pleasure. You know what used to be my guilty pleasure? Though I don't watch it anymore. I loved Jersey Shore growing up. Man, Jersey Shore was the, the the greatest thing in my house. We all would sit down together and watch Jersey Shore every Thursday at 9 p.m. And the funny part is we'd watch it at 9 p.m. And I'd even have friends over to watch it together. We'd be rolling and then all of us would go home or I'd stay at my house because we'd host it. And I'd rewatch it because they'd replay it at 10 p.m. And I'd rewatch it because we were so loud that I didn't catch everything. So I had to rewatch it just to make sure that I caught all the funny. <laughs> Man, I miss those. And you know, 
So this was when I was a lot younger. When was I? I was probably in high school because it was Jersey Shore and I was hanging out with my high school friends. So it must have been, I had to be high school. So crazy times. I just remember <laughs> coming home one day and my dad's watching, watching it like on MTV. And I was like, dad, the heck are you watching, dude? Like, what is this? I see like a bunch of very interesting characters clubbing, you know? I'm like, dad, why are you watching this? He goes, dude, you got to watch it. It's so funny, which is so out of character for my dad. And I was like, dad, I'll watch it. He would always talk trash on anything I ever watch. Because I, I would watch some reality TV, you know, like made and stuff back in the day. And he would talk so much trash on it. He's like, dude, seriously, it's so funny. You got to watch this. So then we start watching it. He was watching it season one. I was like, okay, I'll watch a little bit. And then we started watching. I swear we like binge like every episode. And we just kept going. And now it's a pastime. I, I haven't watched much of the newer seasons, but funny stuff. Oh, there's a couple bananas. Wait, if I hurry up back, actually I got some time. It's only like, it's still pretty early actually. Ooh. I just saw this. Oh, that's why I was heading back. My thing was going to break. I didn't... I forgot. I forgot why I was running back. I was like, wait, I still have so much energy. No, my thing was going to break. I should see if I can make a new axe bomb here. Let me throw some copper in there. Go see what you need for the new axe. Oh, you only need two copper bars. Easy. Oh, nice. And let's close that six. All right, let's just go pop in and do this real quick. Hey, I got some goodies for you. Um, actually, let's see what he wants for today. Maybe I can maybe I can make friends with him first. Would it be too much to ask to catch me a butterfly? Alright, right, let's sell this, these, this, this, this. That's probably good. Sure. All right, so we're looking for... There it is. Wait, where'd it go? I swear that was it. Isn't that a scarlet butterfly? Was that what he wanted? No, I think he said Scarlet, right? Scarlet Butterfly. I thought that was a... Ooh, what are these? I can't even pronounce that word. There's has the word dung in it. I don't know if I want to eat any fruit that has the word dung in it. I'm sure these are probably delish. And they're probably based off their real fruit. So if you like these fruits, my bad. But um, I also... So... I mean this in the nicest possible way. It's going to sound maybe rude, but I'll say it anyways. I was reading through comments and I made like a deal, big deal that everyone likes bananas. And then some people were like, dude, I'm allergic to bananas. And now I feel kind of bad about it, but I have to be honest. Someone literally comments. I go, dude, everyone likes bananas. And then someone goes, I'm allergic. And I just started laughing. I was like, oh, geez. <laughs> How insensitive of me to say everyone loves bananas and I have someone tell me they're literally allergic to bananas. I'm like, oh no. Scarlet, got it. Yeah, 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 yeah. How insensitive. Like, everyone loves peanuts, you know? Peanuts, just the best thing. You know what everyone else likes too? Dairy. I think everyone loves. T <laughs> what else can? What else are a lot of people like allergic to? Mm. 
You know what? No. <laughs> oh. All right, let's go back. John, I'm coming for you, buddy. Then the base keeps running, running, and running, running, and running, running, running. No contact. When you, when I bust around, you break your necks. And I don't know what song that is. What song is that? I'm trying to think of the song's name. Mm. Is that by the Black Eyed Peas? No, that's not by the Black Eyed Peas. I miss the Black Eyed Peas, man. Bring back the Black Eyed Peas. You know, I think it's Fergie's fault. Didn't she leave the Black Eyed Peas? And like Will I Am made her own, made his own thing. I, knew, I got pants? John, give me pants. Is he trying to comment on my pants? Wow. Wow, they are hideous. These yellow? What was he thinking? How much, it? How much does he sell? But, oh, he actually doesn't sell the... Oh, they just sit there. Table saw, torch. Oh, I didn't see that. Oh. Ba ba metal detector. Maybe it wasn't for you who ruined it. I don't know who ruined it. Someone ruined it. Obviously. I want to go make my axe. Maybe we'll have a new visitor tomorrow. That'll be cool. Nice, it does reset it. I was hoping it would. So I wasn't... <laughs> wood, it's an axe. Uh, I wasn't sure if it was going to reset it or not. And it does. Resets its uh, energy, you know. I'm kind of sad. I don't think this is cutting it quicker. Is it just that it has more durability? Or is it cutting it quicker? I can't tell. I also didn't have any other tasks. Are we done with tasks? Maybe we're done with tasks. Maybe that's the entire intro. Might as well throw more in. I don't think there's any other use for this. Alright, guys. Another day down. Let's see how many level ups we got, if any. Woo! Thank you everyone so much for liking, commenting, subscribing. Once again, if you guys are enjoying the series, consider doing those things. I'll have more content up ASAP per usual, but thank you guys for all the love and support. We'll talk soon. How's this go? Oof. Oh, did it give me a level up because of forging? Oh, does woodcutting fall in forging? I'm assuming it does. Level 10, maybe you can make copper stuff? Uh, 23,000 in one day. I can definitely make 90 in one day. I just didn't, you know? All right, guys. Thank you so much for the love. We'll catch you in the next episode. See you, dudes.